let's look at their conditions. We know AB perpendicular to BC, so triangle ABC is a right triangle. And we also know AB equals V, DC equals Y. So if we can figure out the length of BD, then we can use Pythagorean theorem to calculate the hypotenuse AC. In order to do that, we need to create some congruent and similar triangles. So the way is passing through D draw DE perpendicular to AD, and then passing E draw ER perpendicular to BC. Like that. So I already get that figure. Yes. So then we know this angle is Y angle, and here is E. And here also right angle and here is her. So we set BD equals X. Just by intuition, you know, triangle ABD and triangle DFE should be congruent. So right now, triangle ABD and triangle DFE should be congruent. The reasons are as follows. First, we know this 145 degree and right angle. So their angle also 45 degree. That means the, the triangle ADE is an isosceles right triangle. So AD equals DE. So AD equals DE. And we know Angle A, B, D, so angle A, B, D equals 90 degree equals angle D, F, E. Yeah, equals angle D, F, E. And also this angle B, A, D plus the angle B, D, A equals 90 degree. So that means angle B, A, D equals 90 degree minus angle B, D, A. But angle B, D, A plus angle F, D, E equals 90 degree. So that means the difference equals angle F, D, E. So equals that. Okay. So angle, angle, side. So we know these two triangles are congruent. So we get ER equals, EF equals DB equals X. And DF equals AB equals V. So we can get F C equals D C minus D F equals five minus three equals two. That means here three, here two, right? And here is X. Now look at other pair of triangles. Triangle A B C and E F C. So. Again, by intuition, you see they should be similar. So I say triangle ABC should be similar to triangle uh, EFC. Why? Because they have the common angle C and also one right angle, right? So the other angle should also be equal. Anyway, so from here we will get the corresponding sides are proportional. So we get uh, CR over FE to equal to CB over BA. Now CR equals two, FE equals X, CB equals CD plus DB. We know CD equals Y plus BD X over BA, which is three. Cross multiplying, we get X times five plus X. 
equals 2 times 3. So we get x squared plus 5x minus 6 equals 0. Factoring, we know x minus 1, x plus 5, uh, plus 6, sorry, equals 0. So we get x equals 1 or x equals negative 6. But that one is invalid because x is the length. So then we know the length of BC equals uh, BD plus DC. So we get BD 1, DC 5, so we get 6. Finally, we can apply the Pythagorean theorem. So I get AC squared equals AB squared plus BC squared. We know AB squared, 3 squared. BC squared, 6 squared. 9 plus 36 equals 45. Taking square root, so we get AC equals square root of 45, which is 3 times square root of 5. That is the final answer. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.